teaching the program in the quick edit after the quick new process has been selected. The functions selected and the positions selected after the quick new process will appear in the quick editor. They will be numerically ordered. On the quick editor, the keys on the left hand side will allow you to move the axes, jog it, without inputting these values into the quick edit program. Selecting the axis key using the sliders, you can jog the robot to a position without affecting the automatic process cycle. To input a position into a quick edit program, you must select the box that you want to teach, highlight it, select the axes by selecting the white box and clicking, and you can move the axes to the position using the sliders on the right hand side. Inputting the value by checking the green box. You can also teach the axis position by checking the white box and selecting the position and numerically inputting that position by using the keypad. Be aware that if you numerically input a position and input it to the program by checking the green box, that will be executed in the automatic cycle. So always be aware that the position that you have chosen is correct. If in doubt, physically move the robot using the sliders to the position that correlates to the axis position that is needed during the automatic execution. You must teach all of the positions. You cannot leave a position in an undefined state, in a question mark state. Every position must be taught from the numerical boxes, including the reference position, which will allow you to stop the robot midstream and if holding a part, the robot will move to the reference travel placing position and place that part prior to going to the referenced home position. To input a function such as the number of startup rejects, always read the comment, number of shots to be rejected every time the application is started. Select the white box and you can numerically input this via the keypad or use the slider on the right hand side or move the up and down arrow keys. Whichever value you decide on, it must be inputted with the green checkbox. The keys on the right hand side allow you to look at specific items such as positions only, timers only, counters only. The expert tab will have certain functionalities that only those who know that under the expert tab these items are adjustable. For the operator who is not as familiar with the programming this is not necessary. These are defaulted values that don't necessarily need to be adjusted to allow the program to run correctly. To fine tune the program, as an expert user, you can select these and set the buffer time for the eco mode, placing and takeout speeds, straight departure distance using smart removal delta X and early ejector and smart removal move in Delta X. These defaulted values will allow the program to run correctly without fine tuning if the operator is not that familiar with these functions.